This presentation provides an overview of the 600 day weight EBVs that are calculated by Breed Plan and the performance information that is used to calculate them. The Breed Plan 600 day weight EBVs provide estimates of genetic differences between animals in live weight at 600 days of age. The 600 day weight EBVs are expressed in kilogram units with higher, more positive 600 day weight EBVs indicating greater genetic potential to growth to 600 days of age or around 20 months of age. The 600 day weight EBVs are therefore of importance to producers that are trying to turn animals off at around that 20 to 24 months of age, such as in heavy grass fed or grain fed markets. The 600 day weight EBVs that are calculated by Breed Plan are calculated from the weights of animals that are collected by seed stock producers when animals are at or around 600 days of age. While ideally animals will be weighed when they are close to 600 days of age, Breed Plan can potentially utilise weights which are taken when animals are between 501 to 900 days of age. It is important to note that animals do not need to be weighed when they are all exactly 600 days of age, but rather the recommended practice would be to weigh the entire management group or mob of animals when the average age is around the 600 days of age. While ideally one 600 day weight will be perfectly adequate, in some cases sea stock producers may collect up to two different weights in this age range to improve the accuracy of the 600 day weight EBVs. All 600 day weight information which is collected by sea stock producers is submitted directly to the breed plan office. When collecting 600 day weight information, there are a number of considerations that sea stock producers need to make. Firstly, it is very important that appropriate scales and weighing equipment are used and that the scales are checked regularly throughout the weighing process to ensure that the measurements that are being collected are accurate. Further, the scales should be set so that they are weighing animals to the nearest kilogram. When collecting 600 day weight information, it is very important that seed stock producers weigh all animals within the one management group and all animals within the management group are weighed on the same day. Within the breed plan analysis, animals measured on a different day will not be directly compared and so it is very important in terms of maintaining the effectiveness of the performance information and the accuracy of the subsequent 600 day weight EBVs that all animals are weighed on the same day. In a similar fashion, it is very important that seed stock producers try to weigh animals when they are in as large a group as possible so that the number of head on head comparisons within the breed plan analysis is maximised and therefore the accuracy of the 600 day weight EBVs that are calculated is also maximised. When collecting 600 day weight information, it is very important that sea stock producers carefully record management groups to identify any animals which may have had a different opportunity to perform since the last weighing. This may involve animals which are given supplementary feed, animals which may have been joined as yearlings, or animals that might have been managed under a different pasture conditions. The breed plan analysis will automatically take into account any differences in management prior to the previous weighing, which may be the 200 or 400 day weight information that has been submitted to breed plan, and so therefore management group information only needs to be collected and submitted to identify animals which have been managed differently since the last weighing. If the 600 day weight performance is the first weight which has been taken on the animal, then any differences in management since birth need to be carefully taken into account and management groups submitted accordingly. When collecting 600 day weight performance information on heifers, it is very important that sea stock producers carefully consider the pregnancy status of those heifers at weighing. In situations where seed stock producers are calving heifers down at two years of age, the recommended practice would be to take an early weight on those heifers, say at 550 days of age, before the heifers reach three to four months in calf. A practical time to do this may be at preg testing. In a similar fashion, in circumstances where seed stock producers are selling a significant proportion of their bulls prior to when the bulls reach 600 days of age, it is important that seed stock producers carefully consider taking an early weight on those animals so that this performance is not lost from the system and the accuracy of the 600 day weight EBVs that are calculated is maximised. For ease of management, seed stock producers should also consider coordinating weighing for 600 day weight performance information with other management activities when animals may be coming through the yards or the collection of other performance information such as ultrasound scanning 
or scrotal circumference measurement. So hopefully this presentation gives you a better understanding of the 600 day weight EBBs that are calculated by a breed plan and the performance information that is used to calculate them. Further information is available from the technical area on the breed plan website where a range of tip sheets are available or alternatively by contacting staff at the breed plan office on the number listed on the screen.